Welcome back. Welcome back, I say. <coughs> hmm. Time to murder some weird mutated bean creatures, because diplomacy has failed and we need to just capitalize on the violence in this society. Part of me wishes there were just monsters in the world that you could run out and be like, Oh damn, I went to get a carton of milk. Yeah, I know your tricks. Not well enough to dodge them, but I know your tricks. Damn it! But yeah, part of me wishes um, there were monsters in this world where it's, Ah, oh, I've gone to get a carton of milk. Unfortunately, I was attacked by this weird bean monster and I had to step on him a bunch. It was very, uh, very trying. Ha! Suck it, Bean. Mmm, it's tasty. Your blood on my hands. That is what is tasty. Full disclosure, I am a vampire. Anyways, yeah, so rather than get the item, we're just gonna fuck off this way. We can also just go up this way. Taha! Oh shit. No! Damn. Oh, it's Dry Bones. Yes, that's what Dry Bones looks like in this game. Don't question it. Couldn't remember which head, uh... Which head spin attacks which brother. I do know it's different for each brother, though. Well, that's Luigi. Ha ha ha. Oh, Dry Bones. I always kind of like Dry Bones. Had to kill him with that cape, but other than that, you know... He was pretty alright. Ah, uh, yes. This particular puzzle. Mountain Watering Hole. Well, we need the water, certainly. Can't solve this problem without water. We have overhydrated, yeah, but he blasts, stomp on head. Well, we read that already. Good thing Mario's just fat. Ah, that's the problem I face. Didn't have high jump equipped. <coughs> mm. So you gotta naturally spin it. Wow, shit! What the hell? I think I hit down by accident, leading to a um, curious series of events. I wanted that mushroom. Nothing happens if you just jump into this shit. Wee! Good old twisters. Mountain watering hole. Ah! Why did. Ah, oh, shit. I'm supposed to spin jump over that. Because I'm an idiot. There we go. Eh, fuck you. Them, I believe, I need to kill. Been able to skip a bunch of fights so far, but uh, fairly certain I need to kill these guys. Stupid Dry Bones. He isn't even bothering to attack Mario. Up oh, now he's attacking Mario. Thus showcasing the different head spin. Which is what he was. Ooh, a Who Bean! Ugh, I'll talk about those soon. In that particular uh, change. Brief moment, I forgot which way it was. With attacks like that, it's always nice that you can just dodge both of them. With both the brothers, I mean. Doesn't work so well when um, the attacks that can hit both of you start showing up, however. You need to be careful about those. <coughs> 
Ahem. I always thought they made odd faces when they produced those, you know? It kind of looks like they're going, Huya? You can counter that one and do damage to him, but the timing is very specific on that one. You can tell he's going to do it depending on how far away he is when he, uh, stops moving at you. Ta-da! Ah. Damn it! My timing! Alright, you're not gonna get me this time. Ha ha! See? I have foiled you, Dry Bones. What is your name? It's Dry Bones, okay. That's right, the enemies all have names, and they're worth looking at. <sighs> Excellent. Good old leveling up. Alright, uh... Rose points, I guess. Ah! Can't win. Just want them plus three. Some of them have plus fours if they're well enough. You get better bonuses if the stat A is meant to be higher and B... Um... Is meant to be higher and... Like, is one of the ones you're supposed to be, quote, supposed to be better at. It's just the man's way of keeping me down. Fall, and then we rock it across. And that was all just to restart that fountain. So for the longest time, I wondered what the hell was up here. Like, what is this? Because we can't get up there. I have no idea what that is. Like, what is the point of me being able to spin jump over there? It's meaningless. Meaningless, I tells you. Why are they all so keen on attacking Luigi? What did he ever do to them? Poor little dry bones. Being bullied by Luigi. There's Mario, at least. <coughs> there we go. Whee! Okay, I'm going this way. I need to drop down here. Mario obviously... Ah, shit. I was gonna say, Mario obviously can't do anything. Whereas Luigi can jump. I didn't know I had high jump selected. Yeah, Mario can't do shit. All Luigi can do is stomp on his head. And when we get the hammers, uh, you can totally uh, alter that particular fact. You can hit him instead of uh, stomping on him. Nothing over here that we can deal with yet, anyways. Alrighty. Whee! Whee! What is this? Mountain trail. But what's up here? Other than, you know, the need for a high jump. Coins and, I think, a super mushroom? Ah, this bit. So this bit really annoyed me when I was a kid, because I wasn't skilled enough to do it. And is largely what halted progress until I, you know, stopped being an idiot and, uh, you know, got good, as the kids say. Travelers, I am Huhori! Huhuris! Ancient weapon of the Huhu civilization. Beyond this point, the path grows even crueler. You must prove yourselves up to the challenge. Dare you try this challenge? Yes. 
<coughs> you must start now. You must collect 10 who orbs within 30 seconds. Do not fall off the ledges or you will immediately fail. So right away. Ah, it's gonna be that kind of bitch. As long as they're, you know, close to each other. Shit, I failed. Didn't go far enough south. Yes, I'll take the challenge again. There's always, yeah, there's always, like, the chance they can be too damn far away. Yeah, hopefully they're within, like, one... Ugh! Bastard. Yeah, hopefully they're within, like, one little spin of each other. Excellent. Otherwise it just takes too damn long. Ah, I missed it. My own fault. Ah! Got it! With a second and 41 to spare. Now for your next challenge! You must defeat me! My god. Now he's a different color, and he breathes. Let us begin. Ah, yes. I remember this fight. So you gotta trick this son of a bitch. Bink. I will heal once, uh, he's no longer, like, outside. When he's inside the pillars, the attacks are ridiculously simple and easy to avoid. Ah! Botched it right at the end. Okay, so now I'll heal. Wish I had a nut. Which isn't out of context weirdness, that's me legitimately wishing I had the item known as a nut and can heal both brothers at the same time. It looks like a cashew. <coughs> mm. Hey, you can attack both brothers at once. Right now, that's just bosses, but it soon becomes par for the course. There was a year of you, and then they just ignored you. They're like, right, we put in our quota for making sure our adopted child that we secretly hate isn't taken away by some social security types. That was a bit dark. You pass the test, too. Now you must face the test of reaching the summit. And we never see him again. Oh, I need to high jump, eh? If you say so, I believe it's this way. With, yeah, there's an item. I think that's syrup. Eh, probably. How am I doing on syrup? Whoops. How am I doing on. Eh, yeah, we're good. Restored all of my stats after that battle. Excellent. Thank goodness we didn't miss that. That would have been embarrassing. Alrighty. Ah, shit! I was gonna say, have to finesse our way into that one. Finesse is not my strong suit, unfortunately. 
There we go. But how are we gonna get there? Why, we follow this path, of course. Aha! Oh, shit. Don't you do it. Okay. Forgot he was there. My, that would have been embarrassing. My, I would have been so embarrassed. Is it this one? I think it's this one. Yes, it works. Syrup, excellent. You will go well on my pancakes. More syrup, damn. I don't have that many pancakes, guys. You gotta slow down here. Ah, yes, this one. See, every time you enter the uh, tornado, it resets it, so uh, if it's spinning like that, you need to sometimes dart back and forth. Possibly like so. I don't know what that sign says. God damn it. Not what I wanted. Summit ahead. Beware of excessive whirlwind spinning. Touche. Or, you know, rather than get the items and fight the enemies, we could just book it. Book it like Beckham. That's Bendit. Shit. Now everyone knows I'm not up to date on my dated pop culture references. That's my whole shtick. Damn. Oh yes, we've reached the summit. That'll distract people. Ah uh, yes, so we can see the entire kingdom. There's some islands over there. There's an icy patch. There's another island. There's the kingdom. There's a clock tower of some sort. There's the airplane. That's, uh, that's... I think that's the mountain we are currently standing on. There's the desert. Uh, grassy fields. And a foresty area. Yeah, I believe this is like the mountain we are currently standing on top of at the very bottom here. Possibly that, you know, those two bridges can be seen. I'm not sure. Nice little extra detail. Not in the 3DS one, if I'm not mistaken. I think that one was removed. Because they're a bunch of butts. Anyways, let's... Hey, Bablandin, how's it going? Fools! What are you kicking that for? That's a really rare stone. It's called a hoo hoo block. I'll tell you, anyone who tries to kick hoo hoo block down the mountain is a thief in my book. Huh? My name? Oh, right. I'm called Bablandin. What's that? The townsfolk are all worried about me, really, but I didn't mean to make them worried. See, what happened is this I saw Prince Peacely and followed him up here. And I saw this huge egg, it appeared, and I was shocked. I was speechless, which is rare. So anyways, I've just been here keeping the poor egg warm ever since. Yep, that's a deal. I think something will hatch out of it pretty soon. That's what happens with eggs. Oh, it's here! It's time! Wow, it's about to hatch! I can't take the suspense! Well, he's an intimidating figure. Where could that be going? Gee, I wonder whose house that could be. Ah, well, that's a shock. Talk about one crazy egg! And so he crashed real far away in the mountains off in the distance. Look at this dragon with its fancy eyebrows and its goatee. We must destroy it. Ah, shit. Which one is... Fuck. Okay. I remember now.
triple attack. Ha ha ha! No level up? Come on. He's evolving! That's not how Pokemon works. You don't have eyebrows or a goatee. Oh, hey, Prince, what's up? Cheers to your mustaches! This is incredibly dazzling, man, is none other than Prince Beasley! What happened to you? Well, I suppose you could call it a bit of an accident, what, what? I was investigating events throughout the country for this top secret mission I'm on, I'll have you know. I suddenly encountered Gakletta and her vile underling Vorthal here on this mountain. But by the time I realized who the beans were, it was too late. They transformed me into that and shut me inside the egg. My hair is glorious. Is that so? Prince Beach's voice has been stolen. My flying surfboard will take care of this. I wouldn't worry about Prince Peach, I'm sure she'll be fine. Well, I mean, it's a bit of an issue, but okay. At any rate, we should chase after Cacletta. She did take her voice, so I mean, our goals are aligned here. Now I want you to visit Queen Bean in the Bean Bean Castle once you climb down the mountain. And it may be that Cacletta's next target is in the Bean Bean Castle. I'd bet my life on it. Oh, <laughs> here's a gift for me, autographed gauze. Oh, Luigi, you fanboy. Yes, I think a rose matches your green perfectly. You should know the rose at Bean Bean Castle. They're perm if you show the rose at Bean Bean Castle, they'll permit you to enter. Gee, that's a really excellent gift for strangers you don't know. And with that, I must get back to my mission. May we meet again. Whee! What a dazzling figure. And so, Bablandon dropped us off back at the bottom of the mountain. When we come back, we'll start going down the mountain. Thanks so much for watching. I've been Token Lad. Talk to you later. Shooting negotiator. See you around, Ass Clowns.